Hi, I'm Kevin Falvey, Editor-in-Chief of Boating Magazine, here aboard the new for 2017 StarCraft MDX 211 EOB. This is brand new for 2017 and it's loaded with innovation. But before I tell you about that, check out the performance numbers we collected while running the boat on the lake earlier today. Our test boat was powered by a 150 horsepower Evinrude G2 outboard. Our test prop was a Viper, 17 inch pitch, three blade stainless steel. Our test load was two people and we were carrying 40 gallons of fuel. We reached a top speed of 45 miles per hour at 6,100 RPM. Our time to plane was 4.3 seconds, time to 30 miles per hour, 7.7 .7 seconds, and our most economical cruising speed was 31.1 miles per hour at 4,500 RPM, where we burned 6.1 gallons per hour, netting an efficiency of five miles per gallon. This is an MDX 211E model, and the E stands for Entertainment Center. Check it out. StarCraft incorporated this faux stone counter, complete with illuminated drink holders, faucet with a nice sink, grab rail, and plenty of storage underneath. They did all of this for your convenience and retained plenty of seating in the MDX 211E OB. Now the LED lights on that entertainment center, they're part of the SX package, an optional package aboard this test boat. It also included a stainless steel rub rail, courtesy lights, and this great flip up bolster on the helm seat. But for the really big news for 2017, check out what StarCraft's done to the transom of this boat. The swim platform is tremendous, even with the outboard motor. The sun lounge is beautiful, and by flipping up this piece of cushion, we create an aft-facing seat that's perfect for the sandbar. Close it, flip open this section, deploy the kickstand, and a wonderful chaise lounge is created. Now, there's also storage, some of it's lockable, and excellent access to that Evinrude motor. Let's go back to the helm. For more information about this great new StarCraft, visit BoatingMag.com.